do you have were you you were there in the flesh i was i was rehabbing so i was like uh <laughs> i was in the weight room at the, it was in uh oakland so i was in the weight room in the field you know it was right there so i was in the weight room and i seen the commotion and I didn't know what happened then when guys was coming in. They was like, oh, A.B. just called him a crack. You know what I'm saying? I was like, I couldn't believe it. I was like, what? That's the DM. You know, I was like, that's crazy as hell. Yeah. And then I think everybody just lost their down because it ain't like nothing against Bayot or A.B. or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm just talk talking how I seen it. Yeah. But it just felt like everybody lost respect because then, this motherfucker came in the meeting room just apologizing to the team. I was like, what the hell? This shit feel like elementary school. <laughs> like, it's, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if a kid be bad and go to the principal's office, and then they come back and they got to apologize in front of the class. That's what it felt like. It was crazy. I was like, bro, this man, real, he's really still on the team. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, dog. Yeah. And now we on Twitter calling everybody a cracker every day. It's, it's this thing now. That shit crazy, man. Like, oh, my goodness, bro. That Some motherfuckers make money out of anything. That shit crazy, man. <laughs> yeah, bro. It's, 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 it's insane, movie, bro. Right? It's, it's, it's insane because, like, yo, I got to give Mike Tomlin a lot of credit, bro. Yeah, but I always do. I always bro, do. Bro, I, I, I had, had no idea. Years, bro. Yeah. How do you keep the man contained for 10 years and have him producing like that? That shit blows my mind, dog. Yeah. Yeah, bro. Wait, did, how did y'all did y'all know immediately when he came in that it was like, oh, this ain't this ain't it. This I know, it. man. AB is one of the most different people I ever met. Like the first person I can ever put in that same category as AB, as far as like being the most unique people I ever met, was Frank Gore. Like, oh, Frank. Well, I met Frank Gore. What he what it was op, complete opposite now, but yeah. unique though, a yeah. unique individual. Like how he cared, like how he carried himself as far as football. And you know all this stuff. I didn't know much of his off the field stuff when he was in the building. One of the most unique people I ever met. But AB, dog, when he came in talking about himself in third person, I was like, "This shit finna be a show." <laughs> oh, like, this shit finna person, be bro. a show. Because first of all, everybody was hype. Because of course, AB, one of the greatest wide receivers of all time. Ever. We were hype. Nobody could cover him in practice. You know, he taught his shit. But when he did hit the field. When he finally did get some cleats on his feet and a helmet on his head, dog, he went crazy. You like at practice, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> like it was the connection was there. So it was just wild, man. Like <laughs> one more question. While we're on the whole Napa, right, yeah. in Northern California, real